Hello, in this video we will see how to add video and image to a Shiny app. This Shiny app has an RStudio logo image in the sidebar panel and an intro video in the main panel which shows up when the app loads and is replaced by the tabs um, once the user selects a data file. Okay, so let's jump to our studio where we have the UI.R and server.r scripts. Before we start including the code, there is an important step. Go to your R working directory and create a folder named www. Now place the media, that is the video or image which needs to be included inside this folder. The media files should be in www folder, else media would not show up in the app. Okay, back to our scripts. We add the image using the HTML image tag. In Shiny, the tags object is, is used to include the HTML elements. The tags object contains multiple functions that, that helps us in, in including the HTML elements. So let's do names on tags and we will see a bunch of um, uh, HTML elements and we are going to use the image uh, function from the um, tabs object okay we will start with uh, sidebar panel layout section since that is where we need to include the image and the first thing we will do is uh, give a heading powered by and then we will put the image using tags tags dollar ing function src source equals r studio ball png height equals 50 width equals mm -hmm. 50 now let's go ahead and run the app Okay, we now see that the image is already included here and now we can work uh, with uh, including the video. To include video, let's go to server.r. Now, the reason we are going to server.r is the way I have coded this app. We are using uh, render UI to, to get the display in the main panel. You, in your app, uh, maybe you may want to include the video right uh, under main panel. Okay, so server.r right now, uh, when, the, when the app loads, we are returning zero. This is where we need to code uh, to include the video. We'll start with the heading using uh, H6. I will display intro video. This is going to help users to understand the, um, how to use the app. We'll give some space. And then we will use uh, the tags object on video function and we will say source equals the name of the file and type equals video mp4 the width of the video whatever we want say 350 pixels height equals 350 pixel and controls equals controls okay let's go ahead and run the app okay we see that we now have a video as well